Hey, run that shit up, Chase. Be cool. Be cool. You don't want to get wiped out. Get wiped you out. know I'm eating with that pie out. With that pie out. Be cool. Be cool. You don't want to get wiped out. Get wiped you know. What's up, man? It's Big Old Bag. I'm back. We got another video. Y'all make sure y'all subscribe to the channel if y'all haven't already. Hit the like button. Get ready to comment on this one here. So I got another one from the DM. If y'all don't know about the DM, y'all send us suggestions and the questions to the DM at Baglow, B-A-G-G underscore L-O underscore at, on Instagram. Y'all tap in with me. So for this one, we got uh, El Chapo's son arrested in Mexico. Ooh, the Sinaloa cartel. Boy, they, t they tearing Mexico up right now. Comment down below if y'all know about what I'm talking about. The most wanted man on the planet right now. El Chapo's son, they didn't got him. Now y'all know what happened last time. It was 2019. They captured him, but they had to let him back loose because they started tearing the city up. The Sinaloa cartel <clears throat> going against the fucking Mexican military, police, whoever. Tearing the city up to the point they had to let him go. Like, it's too dangerous. They they doing too much killing. They fucking the, they fucking the city up behind this guy. We need to let him go for the safety, the public safety. You heard me. So right now, basically, they had a five million dollar, you know, like bounty on him, like information that lead to his arrest. So I'm thinking, boy, I'm wondering who played with that. Did somebody take them five million dollars and then sold dude out? Cause if you did. Y'all know how it's going to go down. Like, right now, they got 29 people day total, like, combined on both sides. And the number is steady growing. They don't really have a real number right now because it's steady going down. People in critical condition, motherfuckers in the hospital. It's going crazy in Mexico right now. Fucking, what they say, the fucking airport. They, they shooting at planes trying to take off. The whole airport under fire. You can't even leave. Like they say they got like all the major highways and, and the roads and shit like blocked off or with like burning buses and, and big ass 18 wheelers and shit blocking the streets so the, the the Mexican authorities they telling people, look, don't go driving around, don't be going all over, cause <clears throat> right now the Sinaloa cartel is on a the hunt. They're not playing, they want the they want the they they the big dog bro, back, you heard me. Now they say far as like right now rearresting them shit it might lead back to the same thing they had to get him out of the out of there they got him uh outside the capital or some shit like that holding him somewhere in some high security jail you know what i'm saying but still they tearing the city up behind him mexico says that capturing him probably really won't stop the drug flow and you know what i'm saying but it's showing that they got authority they're gonna try to snatch him they're trying to take him off the street Right now, it's really a war going on. The Sinaloa cartel versus the Mexican military. Like, they really trying to get one of their leaders back. He one of the leaders. He's not the top dog. Like, they say his brothers and shit is like top dogs, but he's still a top dog type shit. So, they really trying to get Bro Bro out. So, man, y'all tell me what y'all think about this story. This is crazy. This is crazy. All the people are scared to move around. They know not to play with the Sinaloa cartel. It ain't a joke. It's not a game. They know the, they well respected. Like they literally going to war with the people right now. Like how many motherfuckers you know do that? <clears throat> they really trying to get the boss man out there. By all means necessary. Do y'all really think like it's no gangs out here that have no power like that? Ain't no blood, crib, GDBD, no sets, no no clicks can or would even try that. I think in America. Like, go to war with the military trying to get their people back. Like, really shooting shit up. They popping at the airplanes. Like, you got to go watch the videos. They got a lot of clips of uh, actual video sceneries of what's going on. People inside the airplanes ducking and hiding with the kids crying while bullets flying over the planes. Like, the military is really, like, in effect out there. Like, they everywhere. They, they got their feet soldiers down there trying to protect the people. They really going to war, like, hand-to-hand -hand gun battles, bro. Like, this shit is crazy. You heard me? Anybody got some good footage out there, send it to me. You're welcome to send it to me. You know what I'm saying? Send it to my email or whatever. I'm going to put my email in the description box below. You heard me? Y'all turn it up. Yeah. So, 
Tell me what y'all think. Is this crazy or not? Because this is a wild story. Do y'all think he going to... This the question. Do y'all think the Mexican government going to release him again because how they tearing the city up? Because it looked like they're doing it worse than the first time. Y'all let me know. Peace out.